Hi, I'm Dr. Mike Mills with the Building Blocks of Health TV. You know, headaches are experienced a little differently by everyone. Um, you may feel tired, you could have blurred vision, you could have a stiff neck, or you could be unable to function for the day. Um, and while the symptoms you um, have may vary, they all have one thing in common. They are not normal to deal with frequently. If you've been experiencing headaches, you may be wondering, what type of headache do I have? You know, there are many different types of headaches and knowing which one you have is the first step toward finding relief. So here are a few of the most common headache types. Migraines come in all shapes and sizes. Typically, you'll feel the throbbing on one side of your head. This type of headache can be excruciating. It can have, last up to three days. Uh, you may feel nauseated. You could have uh, difficulty with speaking or even um, be sensitive to light, sound, or smell. Tension headaches are very common and affect up to 20% of the population. They usually consist of a constant dull pain on both sides of your head. Stress, anxiety, and depression are a few of the triggers of tension headaches. You could also get them from dehydration, uh, loud noises, lack of sleep, or even by not getting enough exercise. So in short, living a healthy lifestyle is a great way to get rid of tension headaches. Cluster headaches are usually experienced more by men than women. Um, they will generally feel an intense burning or even a piercing feeling behind one of your eyes. These headaches usually come when you least expect them and they can last anywhere from 15 minutes to three hours. So if you're having trouble with migraine, tension, or cluster headaches, give us a call today. Research is showing that chiropractic care can reduce the intensity, severity, and frequency of many common headaches without medication. Um, our gentle movement-based care may be able to help you break free from the pain of headaches um, and correct the cause. So I'll see you next week for another episode of the Building Blocks of Health TV.